My name is John Billings. Uh, around town, they call me the Grammy Man. We are in Ridgeway, Colorado. We're at 7,000 feet, population 700. It's a beautiful little community with an awesome view of the San Juan Mountains that surround us. I began 31 years ago as the apprentice to the original Grammy maker. His name was Bob Graves. I was in dental school at the time learning how to do casting, and I went by his house to discuss casting with him and discovered that he was losing his kidneys and was on dialysis. As I was visiting him in the hospital one night, shortly before he died, he wanted me to promise not to let the Grammys go, that I keep them and, and continue them. So I made that promise to him. The first Grammy was presented in 1958, and it was almost like a prototype. They, did, they hadn't really nailed it down yet. It was on a walnut base that was about an inch thick, and at one point they decided, well, let's make the base a little taller, so they increased it just a little bit. All of the little subtle changes, if you could morph it, you would, you would see this Grammy breathing. Once the pieces are then cast, then the grinding and polishing process starts. Each Grammy we make, in our minds, it's, it's going to a superstar. You know, it's going to somebody who's given to us, you know, through our lives, and now we're giving back to them. Hi, it's John Billings. I've got some Grammys for you. I've just been blessed to be able to make a living working with my hands, which is something that, you know, I, I want to pass on. I need to pass on. Being the third person to ever make the Grammy Award and keeping it in the family um, means an awful lot to me. Um, it's a promise that I made to my father. My father made this promise to, to his mentor, Bob Graves, and it's something that we're very, very proud of. We're a small company in a dusty little shop in a tiny little town in the mountains, but our, our work is, is recognized around the world and, and goes around the world. All the time I'm thinking, as I'm doing it, you know, I'm thinking about somebody holding up their Grammy and, and, and seeing the smile on their face, and it, it warms the heart.